Hey, what's up? Crazy Fit Chris M here, and I wanted to make this quick video in terms of having good form and posture. Before we actually do any kind of exercises or movements, it's number one important thing is practicing good posture in your everyday life. Whether you're just sitting in the office, driving, washing dishes, just walking about, practicing good posture 24-7 is important, and not just during your workouts. Too many times, too many times people are looking for different exercises to do when they have bad posture to even begin with. So we're gonna go over how to have good posture in your everyday life. Um, the number one thing is having good standing posture. So we're gonna focus on standing posture. So here, what's important is the side angle here. So if you see from the base of my neck here, all the way here to my navel and my hips here, notice how the chest is really up and sticking out while the core is engaged, right? So. It's actually engaged right now, and this is how my posture is when I'm standing, when I'm, when I'm driving. I drive like a granny, so you want to be driving like a granny because it really helps out in terms of engaging your core, having good posture, and it works out your abs and core. When your abs are engaged, your rectus abdominis, the front of your abs here, then it, would do, it takes away the strain from your lower back. Far too many times people have problems with their lower back, and that's because of weakened abdominal muscles. So you want to strengthen your abdominal core muscles. And how you can do that on an everyday basis is having strong posture where your chest is up, not just sticking out, but upwards here. And notice how it elevates my core and abs here and it stays engaged. I'm not here sucking it in so much, but just keeping them up. So notice here, so this is me engaging my abs here, my rectus abdominis. And let me show you what happens when I just release everything. <sighs> notice that? It looks like I'm bloated like I just ate, right? Notice how now it slopes outward here versus sloping upward, right? So again, my, even my shoulders, my shoulders are rolling forward here. Now I'm not even activating my latissimus dorsi, my shoulder blade muscles, that big pulling muscles here, pulling muscles, like when you pull the door, pull a cart. So here, notice, relax, everything's nice and relaxed. So when you now engage again, shoulders back, squeezing the shoulder blades together. Notice a big difference in physique and posture. This is great when you're doing standing exercises like shoulder presses, overhead shoulder presses, um, overhead tricep extensions, when you're doing your back squats, front squats, and a lot of standing leg exercises, it's important to have good posture. And do this even when you're sitting down also, and it's definitely going to improve your posture. Release any kind of lower back pain you may have and strain on your lower back, because again, our lower back is not as strong as our abdominal muscles, our rectus abdominis. You wanna make sure you, you engage more here on your abdominal muscles. So again, shoulders, back, squeeze the shoulder blades together, shoulders down here, not shrugging, keep it down here, head up, chest up, not forward, just chest up, and engaging the abs, taking it from the side view again, notice here, engage, release, even the shoulders roll back, you want to have good posture, roll the shoulders back, squeeze the shoulder blades together, chest up, engage the abs, so practice this on an everyday basis, have a great day.